Hello and welcome to my new scholarship episode. I'm Dr. Mohammed Ikram and you're watching SRJ Africa. In this video, I bring another very wonderful and exciting opportunity for international students. Uh, before we start talking on this wonderful and amazing opportunity, uh, I just want to talk about a very important uh, topic that most of the students have uh, requested me to give some guidelines or some criteria on the basis that we will be able to uh, take this decision which university we have to apply. Uh, so in this video, first I'm going to talk about this most important uh, points that you have to take into consideration before choosing a university for your fully funded scholarship of your uh, bachelor, master or the PhD program. Okay, I will uh, make any another detailed uh, video in the future, but in this video just talk about some important points that you have to really focus on before choosing any university for your further study. The first important and the most, uh, I will say, the significant factor that students have to really uh, focus on is the, the ranking of the university. Uh, because when you will graduate from the university and go for the further education or uh, to find a job in, uh, in any uh, company or in another country or you want to pursue your academic career, whatever uh, the decision you will take uh, regarding your, uh, your career path or whatever. So every company or every employer must focus on the ranking of the university. So there are many different ranking criteria, but the most important and the worldwide that is the QS rank. Okay, so always I have a focus on to make a video that of any university that is the high rank universities, one of the high rank universities in the world. Uh, so that is the most important factor that you should really focus on for taking CN for applying a fully funded scholarship for your further education. The second important uh, point that you really also um, think about this is the uh, the cost of living. Sometimes the university is providing very good amount of stipend and other additional benefits of, for example, the medical or the um, any uh, transportation or some kind of other type of house allowance or whatever. But you also have to pay attention to the cost of living in that country. If I give example of the any Scandinavian countries where the taxes are very high, even though the university is providing very good amount of money, but still it is very difficult for if you have a family, so you cannot survive in that kind of so. Uh, countries with that amount of money. Okay, uh, so ranking number one is the most important thing. Second is the the cost of living of the country, and the third thing is about the acceptability of that program. Uh, for example, some programs are different in, in one university, and if we will compare to that program with other university, maybe there is some big changes. So you have to also focus on what is the acceptability of that program in the market. Okay. So these three points are really important. Number one is the QS ranking. Number two is the cost of living in that country. And number third is the, the acceptability of that program in the market. Okay, uh, so this was about the three important points. So, uh, okay, so I hope you understand now, but I will uh, make a detailed video in the future where I will give more information about uh, so regarding this important topic. Okay, so in this video, I bring a very exciting and amazing opportunity, uh, fully funded National uh, Taiwan University Scholarship 2023 and 2024. Uh, so now the question is this, why the students has to take this need to go to Taiwan for their further education? Okay, so this university, according to US ranking, uh, is one of the top leading universities in the world among the 100 uh, the university list. And this university has 69th position in the world. So 69th position, I believe, is a wonderful and very attractive university for any international students to apply for this university. Number two is this. Uh, Taiwan, as you know, this is uh, the cost of living in Taiwan is not very high. So uh, also it is a very important and this is this, uh, this factor like you easily can take the decision uh, to apply for uh, your further study in this university in Taiwan. Okay, so uh, let's start this video. I will talk all the important section of this video, the eligibility criteria, uh, what are the different financial benefits of this uh, uh, program, uh, this fully funded scholarship uh, that the university is providing national students, uh, what documents you have to prepare for this uh, scholarship, then where you have to upload all your documents, uh, what is the deadline of the scholarship, 
and finally i will share some contact information in case if you are uh looking for any further information to inquire okay so uh, before going to my computer screen if you are new on my channel so please subscribe to my channel and press the bell icon so you will get notification of all my future videos on time we have a whatsapp group uh, you can uh, see the qr code on the screen simply you can scan the code by using your mobile camera and you can join our whatsapp group so let's go to my computer screen and start the process of pre funded scholarship in national university of taiwan Let's start. Welcome to my computer screen. Fully funded National Taiwan University Scholarship 2023 and 2024 in Taiwan. SRJ Africa is a unique platform that provides the valuable information of scholarship, research, and jobs to international students. The main objective of SRJ Africa is to develop a sustainable future in this world. Okay, so let's start first the eligibility criteria. The eligibility criteria is very quite simple. The international applicant having a nationality eligible to apply. Any nationality holder is applicable for this scholarship. Uh, must hold bachelor degree to apply for postgraduate degree program. Uh, so this uh, scholarship is for the master and for the PhD program. So you must hold the bachelor degree. Uh, again, I have to uh, here to point out if you are a result awaiting student, still you can apply for this scholarship. The simple process is you have to get a hope certificate from your previous university. Okay, the third is must be a proficient in the language. So English language proficiency they talk about. There is no such criteria of the IELTS or TOEFL or any international language proficiency. If your uh, last degree was in English, then you are uh, only uh, required to submit the English language proficiency certificate. But if your last degree was not in English, then you have to show a proof that you are uh, eligible, you have enough English language proficiency skills. Okay, so international uh, certifications is, I believe, is uh, enough to fulfill this requirement. Okay, so uh, that's all about very simple and easy eligibility criteria. Let's talk about the second important section of this scholarship is the financial benefits. The university is providing very good financial benefits to international students. Number one is the tuition fee up to uh, 40,000 uh, the Taiwan currency, uh, about $1,333. So, uh, so I believe this in this amount, almost this is fully funded. And this is the almost the full uh, tuition fee framed off. One economy class return ticket for coming to Taiwan and return to your home country plus one a monthly stipend. Okay, so this is also uh, the university will give you one economy ticket uh, for coming to Taiwan and going back to your home country plus one monthly stipend. This is extra than the monthly stipend the university will provide to international students. That's every month. Number third is the monthly stipend is about one thousand United States dollars, thirty thousand Taiwani. Uh, currency so one thousand dollars is enough money to live a very good life in Taiwan. Okay, uh, so this all about the financial benefit the university will provide to international students who will win the scholarship. Let's move to the third important section of the scholarship is the documents you need to prepare for the scholarship. So as I mentioned in all my previous videos, more than ninety percent documents are all are similar to for all the universities. So if you have applied at you have prepared documents for an inter scholarship in another university. So I hope there is no additional documents that you have to prepare for this university. So that's, I'm going to show the list of documents that you are required to prepare for this scholarship. The number one is up, the updated CV. Okay. And uh, study plan, one page maximum. Uh, so about the, your CV, if you don't have any professional CV template, you can go to the description of this video. The link is available there. So you can download all the party professional uh, CV template free of cost. Okay, uh, study plan is the one page. Also, we have some samples also on my website. So, link is also in, in the description where you can get some information, guideline, how, how to write a good study plan. Okay, uh, two recommendation letters. Also, I have uh, already uploaded the template, uh, three different templates of recommendation letters. You can download, edit your information, and you can ask any other two professors from your previous university who will provide you the recommendation letter. So, you, you need two. Uh, recommendation letter for this scholarship. Degree certificates, uh, your degree uh, diploma, if you have received, if you did not receive, as I mentioned in the 
beginning of this video you can also use a hope certificate for this uh, uh scholarship to fulfill the requirement so it's not a problem uh degree transcripts uh, transcripts is uh, uh where you have the detailed information of your uh, all the subjects that you learn uh that and the different uh, gpa right uh, total scores or gpa that you um, achieve during your bachelor or the master program and uh, pro proof of language proficiency as i mentioned there is no mandatory requirement of international language proficiency if your last degree was in english then it's enough to provide the english language proficiency certificate from your previous university okay uh, so that's all about the documents you need to prepare for this scholarship so now let's move to the next important uh, uh, step of the application process uh, so before talking about this application process i'm going to show what are the different programs the university is offering to international students so almost all the fields are covered uh, by this university so here is the complete list uh, departments graduate institute department of foreign language and literatures graduate is, uh, institute of arts history institute of uh, musicology now uh, physics geoscience ge ge geography uh, astro astrophysics applied physics are uh, many all the other type of uh, uh, sciences fields are available uh, pharmacology my microbiology uh, so oral biology uh, civil engineering mechanical chemical engineering sciences and ocean engineering material sciences and engineering biomedical so you can see all all the fields are uh, available for this fully funded scholarship in national university of taiwan so this is the complete list of uh, the program the university is offering to international students and you can also get more information once you will start creating your account go to their online uh, platform where you have to submit your application and you can get more information about these uh, uh, the list of this program that university is offering to international students okay so next is the online uh, application process uh, so one thing is this university has a application fee, uh, eighty United States dollars. Uh, so I believe eighty dollars is not a big amount, but the opportunity is very big. Uh, so my personal suggestion is this: you must try uh, this scholarship because this is a wonderful opportunity from all perspective. The ranking of the university, the cost of living, the acceptability of this your degree in the market. So that's why this is the win-win situation. Eighty dollars is, I believe, is not a big deal. You can easily uh, pay the application fee for this scholarship. Okay, uh, so I'm going to show the the, uh, the platform where you have to uh, fill your application form and where you have to get the information. So now, uh, 2024 February and three of you will apply now, and you will get the scholarship. So you have to go to Taiwan uh, next year in February 2024. Okay. Uh, so here is the complete information, create an account, create your personal information, uh, select up to five departments. You can apply in more than one department, mean five departments maximum, recommendation, actual upload documents, application fee, examination and interview, and online application system uh, for 2024 February entry will open August 1 to October 5, 2023. 4 p.m. Uh, Taiwan Standard Time. Okay, uh, so now uh, we are in July. Uh, then next month, the, the 1st of August, they will open this platform. Uh, so simply you can go and click on the create an account. Then it will go redirect to that uh, portal where you have to create an account and you have to fill all the personal information, upload all the documents. Okay, so August 1st to October 5th. So this is uh, the online platform, the application timeline, the deadline of the scholarship is October 5, 2023. If you want to uh, apply for the uh, entry, uh, February 2024. Okay, so if you will have any further query to inquire or any information you wanna, uh, you wanna get, so you can also contact uh, the Office of International Affairs they are very active, so simply send an email on this email address oia at the rate of ntu.edu.tw and they are very responsible and very active, so within uh, two to three working days or sometimes on the same day you will get the uh, response from the university. 
Okay, and if you will have any further query, you can also leave a comment. So I would like to answer your queries on time. Uh, so that's all about the fully funded uh, National Taiwan University Scholarship 2023-2024 in Taiwan. I hope you understand the easy and simple process. Uh, so if you are new on my channel, so please subscribe to my channel and press the bell icon. You will get the notification of all my future videos on time. Uh, also, we have a WhatsApp group. Simply, you can scan the, the QR code that is appearing on the screen and join our WhatsApp group. Okay, so I wish you uh, good luck for this fully funded and amazing opportunity uh, in Taiwan. And uh, see you in the next video with more valuable information of scholarship, research, and jobs. Take care. Have a good day.